I ain't gotta say nothing. Y'all see it. <laughs> What's up, YouTube? Uh, back with another update on this big girl. <clears throat> she grow, she's blowing up on me. Uh, we confirmed her about, I think about two weeks ago uh, via ultrasound. And on the ultrasound, they saw, she saw about eight pups. But we probably expecting a little more. Uh, I really was doing this breeding mainly just for us, so I was really hope I really and truly was hoping for maybe two or three pups. But I guess it's just making up for all the years that I missed out on <clears throat> uh, the stud. He's just a little bit taller than her. He's got a bigger head than her. Uh, so he he gonna add bone. Well, he got bone. We expecting him to add to her. Um, I ain't gonna do a breeding unless it's something that I really feel like I can build off of. And, uh, she probably won't be bred too many more times if she bred again. Either way, so I ain't really big on breeding bullets right now. I'm looking to get into some more stuff for the time being. So, I mean, I, I really just, like I said, just looking for two or three pups for us, you know, just to have for pets. But we got way more than what we expected. So I'm, I'm expecting, I'm expecting eight. But really, I mean, just mainly because of the ultrasound. But I'm, I'm really expecting about ten puppies. I mean, maybe. I mean, pups do die. I, I don't want them to, and I hate it for it. But I mean, at the end of the day, if if if, if they're not supposed to live, they're not supposed to live. I mean, to some people that's harsh. But I mean, you gotta understand you know, that's that's just life, and that's that's dogs. I mean, every dog ain't supposed to live in the wild. It's, I mean, it's natural selection. What lives gonna live and what dies gonna die. I mean, that's about all I can say about that. I mean, if you don't get it, then I understand. But like I said, man, if y'all really, if y'all are interested, uh, I, well, you can comment below, and um, uh, I more than likely I might, I might end up putting my number down here. I'm trying to get a number just strictly for my uh, dogs. Cause just like you know, like anybody else, I don't really answer random numbers. So if I go ahead and set that number up just for my dogs, then uh, you know I, I I answer you. I you know I I rather text, but I mean I, I can talk to you. It's, it's no problem to talk to you on the phone or anything. But I mean I won't like I used to uh, about probably about two weeks. We'll start taking deposits. I mean. It's been a long time since I had puppies, probably over, probably about two years. Uh, so I'm gonna have to get back in the swing good. And then, I mean, it, it all depends on how good of a mother she is too. But that, that two week mark usually give you a good indication on what, what you're gonna have and what you're not gonna have, so. I mean, that's that. Uh, we can discuss prices on the phone over text. I mean, like I said, I wasn't even expecting to sell these puppies, but with that being said, if I'm having more than what I wanted to have, the price, the price is gonna be decent. I mean, I'm not gonna say I'm giving them away. I mean, I have no problem keeping them. I was laying out here. I mean, I'm definitely not worried about keeping no puppies or not. They have plenty of space to run around, which I mean, they're gonna run around as soon as they're able to step foot outside. I'm gonna socialize them. Probably, I'm more than likely gonna make them better than her. As long as they attitude, you know, their personalities let me i mean some some personalities you gotta work with a little bit more but i mean i'm uh we're gonna do our best this time since we're home more now so we can look at every pup and i, I really just want to match personalities with personalities uh we'll do a little phone interview i get a couple questions together because i mean i, I really don't want to let these puppies go but if we're gonna have i mean if we're gonna have pups to to, to let go. I mean, I'd rather pet home. I mean, you know, the pet, the pet home fee would be a, 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 not a significant, significant amount lower, but it'd be lower. Uh, and they will have to be fixed depending on the puppy. If I want to let go of a puppy that I feel is breeding stock, then, you know, we can work out a price or, or, or however it needs to go. I mean, I ain't hard to work with, but if you try to do me wrong, then, I mean, just natural. You won't get dealt with at all. Um, I love these dogs. I mean, I try to get them as much attention as I can and pretty much everything that I can give them. They basically survive on their own. 
naturally. So I, I give them more natural, natural, you know, more close, get them more close to nature as I can. You know, at natural sunlight and all that stuff. I don't, we don't try to baby the dogs like human beings. We, I mean, that's, that's not really love to me. I understand some people, you know, people like to have pets in the house, which I mean, I did too, but they weren't as healthy as the dogs that I had outside and dogs that have survived over years too. So, I mean, I can understand we don't chain our dogs up or anything. Uh, I did that a long time ago and I regret it. Uh, I didn't know any better. So, I mean, a lot of us did, so. It is what it is. That's the past now. But <clears throat> they they are outside throughout the day. And I bring them in at night. You know, if it's too cold outside, I bring them in overnight. But other than that, they're, they're going to be dogs. They're dogs. But this litter that she's going to have, they're going to be inside from, you know, we're about to go ahead and take her inside uh, maybe today. Today or tomorrow, we still got to get the area straightened out that we want that that's not that area that's an old uh dog pen that was out here i moved it over to make like a little outside puppy pen for when the pups of age i'm gonna get that straightened all out too but that's where it used to be it had sat there for some years spice come on come on but yeah we're gonna work we're gonna work real hard with this litter uh yeah i figured she was about to do that as well i wouldn't worry about it but we're gonna work real hard with this litter here and uh, make sure that they socialize. I have no problem taking taking the time needed to work with these dogs, especially now and knowing what's out there and what you could possibly get from something, you know, that people don't barely take care of. Just, you know, just putting out there for pictures and all this stuff. I want, I want to stand behind my name, something good behind our name, so. Which this may be may be the only litter behind my name, and I want to make that the best one regardless. And that's gonna be the same way with all of them. But like I say, uh, you can comment, like the video if you like like dogs. <laughs> I mean, you wouldn't really be watching dogs if you didn't like dogs, or so wouldn't be watching this video, I would think. But she's real low to the ground. She'd make a nice apartment dog far as the puppies because they're not going to be much taller than her. I don't expect them to be that much taller or too much bigger than her. They're going to be bigger than her just because the fact that the, the dad is. So. You ain't got to get all up on me. <laughs> but we're going we're gonna to hope this one. Well, this is going to be a, 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 a positive thing, a good litter. She's going to take care of them. I'm going to speak it to existing, so. Probably gonna be the best one in some years from us. So come a long way with the dogs and just sticking to pets and want to pet home most of these. Cause I mean, I said it again, I wasn't expecting that many. And that's that's the honest to God truth. I really wasn't. I didn't want this many puppies, but if she gonna have them, then I mean, it's a reason for it. And uh, like I say, uh, this Dynasty Bulls, I'm gonna sign out. After this long little minute, I ain't think I'd be this long winded talking, so. But it's something I, I love, so. And a hobby of mine. And my son coming, so. I ain't trying to get him to be talking like me too much. But like and subscribe if you like. If you like what you see. I mean, puppies will be coming soon. Via C section. Y'all have a good one.